welcome to our symposium for the 10th anniversary year of the New Zealand Republic of Korea Friendship Societies. Mm -hmm. We are celebrating our 10th anniversary and I wonder if you can recognise anyone who was at the first meeting in 2007. <laughs> Some of those people sadly have died, others have moved away, but one or two people uh, looking a little more experienced are, uh, are still here. <laughs> this was a very recent meeting, so this is 10 years on. Um, our society is still going well, and that was very recent. And uh, This is the logo for the symposium. On the right-hand side, de designed by a local woman, another Jong Mi, <laughs> a Jong Jong Mi. And instead of having the dove, which is a very natural and potent symbol of peace, we chose the little bird, the godwit, as our symbol. The, the godwits fly from New Zealand, where they've spent six or so months, and they fly to Siberia and Alaska. And uh, on that journey, they stop in and around China and the Korean Peninsula. They don't know political boundaries. And uh, one of the key, key links between New Zealand and North Korea has been ornith in ornithology, of all things. So it's uh, very interesting. Anyon Haseon. Um, good evening, everybody. And um, thank you very much to Richard and Yungmi for um, your welcome here, and but your great work um, within the society um, over many, many years, from Anzac Day to um, to other cultural and significant events. That's really important in keeping uh, that cultural awareness and, and, and visibility um, in our communities. So I think they've done an excellent job and, um, and we should be very thankful for them. With the, uh, the, the increased tension you're seeing around the region, it's great to have speakers here um, that will be able to give us a bit of a fresh insight into their particular view um, of what's happening um, in the Korean Peninsula and also uh, wider than that because it does affect us all. We do also have a very vibrant Korean community in Hamilton and I'd just like to acknowledge Roger and the work he did um, over many, many years as a representative of that link between the veterans and the Korean community. Korean people amongst us. It's a reminder to me when I hear that singing that the, the question of reunification of the Korean Peninsula is a question primarily for Korean people themselves. And I think the role of uh, those of us who are not Korean is uh, we have a many faceted role, but one is to, as we're doing tonight, provide a context in which talks and discussions can take place safely and openly with the support of interested and uh, dedicated people who are not Korean but take a strong interest in the Korean Peninsula with warm Korean friends. You know, it's always amazing to um, uh, see and catch up with the Korean community, but I see that there are so many of you who are not Korean as well. So thank you for coming here to talk, you know, listen to the uh, incredible speaker who's going to be giving us a lecture, and I'm looking forward to the, uh, the lecture, uh, and particularly when you listen to the news about what's happening, you know, in North Korea, and, you know, and, you know everyone has family uh, in the region. 
and uh, I'm particularly worried about my own family. I rang up my father, you know, panicked that, you know, Dad, you need to get out of South Korea, and he just laughed at me. So <laughs> uh, I think, you know, when you consider the fact that, you know, Korea has been under threat, technically the war hasn't actually finished since 1953. So I, and I was thinking back to my childhood in the 70s when I was growing up in Korea, that the sirens would actually go off, and you know, we would always be looking for the bunkers and trying to actually get out, thinking that there would be another war happening. But war has actually never ended in, in the peninsula. So, and I see that my Korean veterans are here. Dads, nice to see you. 안녕하세요, 여러분. 아, 교민들 언제든지 하, 여기 해물천 내려왔을 때 봤을 때 언제든지 너무나 반갑습니다. 제가 해물천에서 이렇게 행사하는 걸 갖다가 많이 아, 오지는 못했어요. 아, 행사를 하실 때마다 국회가 있어가지고 아, 언제든지 못 오지만 언제든지 오면은 너무나 반갑게 아, 해주, 환영해 주셔서 너무나 감사합니다. 그리고 해물천에서도 열심히 하는 우리 회장님 아, 너무나 감사하고요. 아, 저를 블레이밍 하실 거예요. 그, 아, 그 일렉션 때 이게 막 아, 제가 이게 뭐 약간 힘을 썼다고 힘은 저는 보이칭이 할 수가 없어가지고 힘을 못 썼지만 아 우리 회장님이 너무나 열심히 하시는 모습을 보고 제가 아 우리 고정 고정민 회장님을 아더 하시라고 빨리 빨리 아 한국 교민들을 위해서 더 많이 일을 하셔야 된다고 제가 말씀을 드렸습니다. 아 우리 교민 여러분 열심히 일하시는데요. 뉴질랜드에서 지금 아 총선이 이루어지고 있습니다. 아 여러분들도 한 표. 아, 어느 당이라고는 제가 말씀 안 하겠습니다. 하지만 한 표를 언제든지 던져 주시고 그리고 당 선택하실 수 있고 그리고 아, 국회의원을 선택하실 수 있습니다. 한 표, 여러분지, 여러분들이 아, 투표하시는 한 표가 제가 하는 한 표하고도 똑같습니다. 더 크고 작은 게 없어요. 여러분하고 저하고 똑같습니다. 그러니까 11일부터 시작하는 아, 총선 투표, 아, 일찍 하는 걸 우선 투표라고 하나요? 우선 투표가 11일서부터 시작하고요. 23일 날이 총선이니까 아, 선거를 꼭 참여하셨으면 감사하겠습니다. 아, 한국 교민분들이 많이 아, 총선에 참여하셔서 투표율을 올릴 수 있으면 좋겠습니다. 아, 저는 국민당 국회의원입니다. 감사합니다. <웃음> 귀여워라 여러분 Lovely to see you all here tonight It's Friday night I know everyone is busy And it's an uh, old tradition to be with friends on Friday nights 안녕히 계세요 I'm Kim Somnida for the very kind invitation To um, speak to you today I'm, I'm very privileged uh, to be here My interest is really in Taiwan and China That's where my experience has been I was in China or in Taiwan with a Presbyterian church in Taiwan and working there and my PhD thesis was on translation into Chinese of the Bible. I'm secretary of the NZDPRK Society but we work very closely with the New Zealand Republic of Korea Friendship Society and Richard and I had a little joke last night that at least we are unified. Today I'd like to talk about the obvious reunification discourse especially from a theological perspective. The maps has got um, the name of the sea. Sea of Japan or Donghae. And the second one is um, Republic of Korea. Not only think about the questions of, of Korean division uh, from um, the art world. Yeah. 